Another person is found dead in a field behind Bonnet Drive in Norfolk. Now Norfolk police are investigating two homicides. This morning, a person was found shot there just 17 hours after the first victim. Sarah Hammond has what we need to know about those back-to-back -back crimes. Norfolk police have had this field behind Bonnet Drive taped off for more than 12 hours now as they work to learn who shot and killed someone here early Friday morning. Two homicides in two days in the same spot. It's traumatized, man. It needs a change. Thursday, we told you a neighbor who did not want to be identified found a body in this field behind Bonnet Drive in Norfolk and called 911. Norfolk police did not say how the person was killed, but said they are investigating it as a homicide. I thought it was just clothes laying on the ground. But once I got closer towards the situation, I discovered and noticed that it was a dead body. Less than 24 hours later, Norfolk police responded to a call in the same location and found someone else had been killed, this time shot to death. Officers had the scene taped off from 1 o'clock in the morning to well after the sun came up into the afternoon as they continued to investigate. After the second death in two days, neighbors say they are afraid to speak out. However, one man said this is very unusual for the area and it's scary to see this happen back to back. He says the neighborhood is on edge. A woman who claims to be the first victim's grandmother says he just turned 20 years old. This all happened right behind the academy at Rosemont and with so many children in the area, this neighbor says he's concerned about the children who walk through and play in that field. And it's not safe for the kids. It's like because they just coming through and doing senseless shootings like that. In Norfolk, Sarah Hammond, 13 News Now.